Hello audience, my name is Lucy. I wish you happiness and prosperity. Lucy would like to welcome you for visiting my YouTube channel Health Fitness and here is the official news. One, Tim Walls as kids, meet the Minnesota governor's daughter Hope and son Gus Tim Walls, the governor of Minnesota and Kamala Harris's vice presidential candidate, is a father of two. A daughter named Hope and a son named Gus. He married his wife, Gwen, in 1994, and their children were born in 2001 and 2006. Following a seven-year IVF journey that has shaped his views on reproductive rights, Walls often shares family moments on social media and discusses his children during campaigns. Hope, their eldest, was born on January 9, 2001. 2. Douglas Emhoff Five things about Kamala Harris's husband Douglas Emhoff made history as the first second gentleman of the United States when his wife, Kamala Harris was sworn in as vice president on January 20, 2021. Kamala Harris became the first female, black, and South Asian vice president after their victory over Donald Trump and Mike Pence in the November 3, 2020 election. Following the announcement of their win, Douglas shared a heartfelt photo on Twitter celebrating Kamala's achievement. He was also present during their first speeches as president-elect and vice-president-elect, showing his support by holding her hand. 3. Matthew Perry's Cause of Death How the late Friends actor died Matthew Perry's cause of death has been officially determined to be the acute effects of ketamine, according to a report by TMZ. The toxicology report indicated that he had undergone ketamine infusion therapy for depression and anxiety less than two weeks prior to his death, which led to cardiovascular overstimulation and respiratory depression. His death certificate, released by the Los Angeles County Department of Public Health, noted that he passed away on October 28 at his home in Pacific Palisades, California and he was buried at Forest Lawn Memorial Park in Los Angeles. For John Amos's kids. Meet the Good Times star's children, Shannon and Casey Amos John Amos passed away on August 21 in Los Angeles at the age of 84 due to natural causes. He had a prolific career spanning over five decades, known primarily for his role as James Evans Sr. On the television show Good Times, where he portrayed a dedicated father focused on education and family values. Amos is remembered for his contributions to positive African American representation in media. He had two children, Shannon and KC, with his second wife, Noelle J. Mickelson, from whom he divorced in 1975. Shannon Amos, born on August 5, 1966, is the couple's first child. 5. John Amos's Family Drama What Happened Between the Late Actor and His Kids? John Amos, known for his roles in Good Times and Roots, faced family drama before his death at 84. His daughter, Shannon Amos, accused his son, Kelly Christopher Casey Amos of neglect and claimed their father was a victim of elder abuse and financial exploitation. Both John and Kelly denied these allegations. Following John's death in August 2024, Shannon expressed her grief on Instagram, revealing that she and other family members learned of his passing through the media and were left with many unanswered questions. 6. Kamala Harris's Kids, Facts About the Vice President's Children After the November 2020 Election, 
Vice President Kamala Harris and her husband, Second Gentleman Douglas Emhoff, gained significant public attention. As she nears the end of her term with President Joe Biden, Harris is focused on her campaign for the November 2024 election. With Biden endorsing her as the Democratic candidate, the couple, who have a strong bond, are navigating their blended family, which includes Harris' role as Mamala to Emhoff's children. Cole and Ella, the text hints at the family's dynamics and their public interest. 7. Millie Bobby Brown's husband, everything about her relationship with Jake Bongiovi Millie Bobby Brown. A prominent actress known for her roles in Stranger Things and the Enola Holmes series announced her engagement to Jake Bongiovi, son of rock legend John Bon Jovi, on Instagram in April 2023. The couple, who began dating in 2020, secretly married in May 2024. At just 20 years old, Millie has become a major star. Gaining fame for her portrayal of Eleven in Stranger Things, which premiered in 2016. 8. Tim Walls' wife, everything to know about Gwen Walls' Tim Walls. The Democratic Party's vice presidential candidate and governor of Minnesota gained national attention following the vice presidential debate on October 1st. As he prepares for the November elections, he receives support from his family, including his wife, Gwen Walls, who has shared her pride in his commitment to service and their shared values from their teaching days. Gwen is also an educator and has held administrative roles in the school system. 9. Was John Amos fired from Good Times? The truth behind his character's exit John Amos. The acclaimed actor known for his role as James Evans Sr. on the groundbreaking sitcom, Good Times, passed away on August 21 in Los Angeles at the age of 84 due to natural causes. His career spanned over five decades, during which he made significant contributions to television and film, particularly in promoting positive African-American representation. Amos's character was written out of Good Times in Season 4 and killed off in an automobile accident. The show was notable for being one of the first sitcoms with an all-black cast. Achieving high ratings and historical significance. Both Amos and his co-star Esther Roll expressed concerns about the show's direction during its run. 10. J.D. Vance's Children Meet the vice presidential candidate's kids J.D. Vance, the Republican vice presidential candidate, faced backlash after past comments about childless cat ladies resurfaced. During the July 2024 Republican National Convention, he emphasized that his greatest achievement is being a father and providing for his children, contrasting his upbringing with their experiences. He humorously addressed his kids during his speech, urging them to go to bed. The text also hints at more information about his family, including his wife, Usha Vance.